Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I thought I'd do an Aldi shopping grocery haul because I haven't done one in a while and I like doing them and that's a bit weird. Um, so I'm going to start with the fruit and veg because if I start with the fruit and veg then the rest of it seems healthier. So some of these things will be for Aldi's lunch boxes and some will be for dinners and lunches. So some carrots, we like quite thin small ones which I'll probably peel and just stick in Aldi's lunch box. Some potatoes, again, used for kids' dinners, make wedges and mini baked potatoes. Some small apples, some little oranges and bananas, um, which these will be gone in all these three in about two days because Genevieve lives on fruit. Um, and a stir fry pack, it's kind of cheating, but we're going to have a stir fry tonight. Got some chicken in the freezer, so that'll be for me and Tom. It's not enough, probably, for both of us to make a small pack, but I'll add some fresh peppers and onions and stuff to it. Um, two bags of frozen diced onions, which are really handy for like bolognese and chilli and curry. And a bag of frozen mixed peppers, which again, just lazy, quick cheats. On to the rest of it, I've got some dried apricots, probably just for me, because I don't know if the kids will actually eat them, how many will probably be like, what the hell is that? I'm not eating that. So I'll try and get her to try one for lunch, for school. Um, but I was looking for sweet things that aren't chocolate or biscuits for me. Because I'm going to like try and have a very low gluten or gluten free week. Because um, I keep suffering with like a really painful belly. So I'm going to try and cut out wheat. So although you are seeing wheat stuff, this isn't for me, this is for the kids. Um, so yeah, those are for me. Eggs are mainly for me. Um, fresh pasta, the tortelloni, ham and sausage for the kids because it's really quick to make for dinner. And some fusilli and I've got pesto to go with that. Um, I'm going to make a chilli towards the end of the week so I'm going to cook a bit of satta, two of those and two, two chopped tomatoes. So yeah, pizza for the girls' dinner because Jeremy has a friend coming round after school today. So her mum was bringing a pizza and I said I'd get one. I bought a spinach and ricotta to make it seem like I'm like a healthy parent who buys not just boring cheese and tomato pizza, even though that's what Emily will eat. I bought yeah, tomato puree, which is also for the chilli, pesto I've said, garlic granules, again just because it's easy and lazy. Um, fruit and fibre cereal bars, which tells you don't have much like a choice of cereal bars. Well they do, but um, I don't want a cereal bar that's got chocolate on the bottom. But both of their kind of normal cereal bars have both got chocolate on the bottom, so that's what I bought. The other ones are like biscuity ones. So I've got those for like a pre-gym snack. I've got me some dark chocolate and orange rice cake bars. Um, chocolate chip brioche. Again, for the kids' snacks for like before gym and stuff. They need like high carb. Like something they'll eat quickly in the car. Um, and also Rafe was hungry in the trolley. Whole meal bread, um, again how many lunch boxes and also Tom wants me to make him pack lunches as well. So I'm going to give him like a frozen lunch box or something, which he will love. A big pack of mints for the chilli, two things of milk, um, shampoo and conditioner for me and deodorant, two packs of refrigerators, just the like snacking chicken, what was it, roast chicken flavour. They do like breaded or just non breaded, so I love the non breaded. Um, a two pack of smoke alarms, which they just happened to have in store and I actually needed to get them because ours was beeping the other week and I went to test it and it wasn't working. So luckily they had them in store today and I just picked them up because I saw them. Um, some savoury vegetable rice to go with the kids' dinners, um, just like to keep in the cupboard as a standby. Some low fat yoghurts for the girls or for the kids, some chocolate tea cakes. My favourite um, for the little play day after school. And some you know added sugar, um, Greek style yoghurts for me. And then last but not least, some fizzy orange sugar free and some white vinegar just to do like, cleaning with. Um, it helps remove smells and stains from things, and that's about it, I think. So yeah, sorry, I'm a bit rushed, but I need to get it away and then start cleaning the house because there's bits of wood everywhere, as you can see, because Tom and his dad put a new door in at the weekend. Yeah, 
I hope you enjoyed this mini haul. Not much of it, but it's kind of a mixture of all sorts of styles of eating. Um, yeah, don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you like this kind of weird video, and please tell me you do because I like making them.